What's up, Taters? This is Tree from TreeOfALogic.com, and you all know that video I uploaded about two days ago where I was talking about uh, the arrest warrant I have out of Germany for hate speech. And I think many of you know that because a lot of you were here when I first came on the scene in 2016, and I actually did a video uh, crying about it, boohooing about it in my car. Um, let me just say this, that I know how it feels to have a newfound love for your country. Now, truth be told, I never hated my country. I never hated my country. I never sat down doing a national anthem. I've always stood up, head held high, hand over my heart, and I would sing, okay, the national anthem. And I will also say the Pledge of Allegiance. I totally love my country and appreciate it. And I think when you live other place you live somewhere else you appreciate it more now this is nothing compared to Brittany Griner okay <laughs> she was not just living in another country she was in that country's jail and um the tears that she has now is you can see it's sincere now let me remind you guys she was all part of the BLM movement and all about when all these clowns was taking a knee or kneeling during a national anthem. She was about that too, or she would stay in her locker room and just totally disrespect the flag. Then she decided to bring a little wacky weed and liquid form to vape over there in uh, Mama Russia. And they was like, uh-uh, you ain't going to be going back to America no time soon. So she was incarcerated there. She was found guilty uh, for nine years. No, found guilty and she was going to serve nine years. And, of course, we did an exchange and got her back. Blah. Anyway, and so she's back. And she says she has a newfound uh, love for this country. Now, I could continue to hate her. But believe it or not, I could tell she really does care about this country now. And it's unfortunate that it wasn't the fact that her father was a vet. Okay? It's unfortunate that she didn't care that her father was a Vietnam veteran. Right. And that he loved the military, the army, by the way, that did not get her to love it. Like the fact that she had to get locked up, locked up for her to appreciate America. Ain't that something? Hey, whatever road you choose, as long as you end up in the same place of loving this country, because it is the best country. It is. <laughs> it sure ain't the UK. Look at what they're going through right now. And it's damn sure ain't better than no dag on Germany. Y'all already know about that. But I'm going to show you the video. Now, I have to be careful. Hold on, hold on. Let's be clear. I'm going to read this article, and then I'm going to show you the video. But I'm going to have to be very careful with showing you the video. Uh, I'm, I don't know. I may have to put something over it because I'm not trying to have them, uh, the Paris Olympics try to dag on copy content or take the video down. So everybody's video was taken down except for mine. And that's because I used the steel. I went from one steel to another and to another. I didn't play uh, more than five seconds of it. So we'll see how it goes. I didn't even rehearse this part. So let's see uh, how it goes. I'm going to read this article and then I'm going to show you the video. Well, I'm going to do my best to show you the video without getting uh, hit. Newfound gratitude. Brittany Gr Griner cries during a national anthem at the Olympics. They won the gold, by the way. So they won the gold medal. I, I think either France or the UK won second. I don't know. Y'all know what it is. Second place is first place loser, okay? All right, those of you who play sports, you understand that. Nothing makes you appreciate American freedom more than being locked away in a foreign prison for nearly a year. Case in point, Brittany Griner, the formerly outspoken critic of the national anthem, was seen with sentimental tears streaming down as the Star Spangled Banner was played during the medal ceremony at the Olympics. In 2022, Griner spent almost 10 months in a Russian prison after being arrested for drug charges. The WNBA star was set to, be, to serve a nine-year sentence. Oh, man, that, that, look, that better be some good old weed for you to be up there for that long, girl. I swear it wasn't even worth it. Anyway, let me read that again. The WNBA star was set to serve a nine year sentence until being released during a prisoner exchange between the United States and Russia, where a high profile Russian arms dealer 
was traded in return. The entire event seems to have prompted a change of heart for Griner, who stated in 2023 her intentions of standing for the national anthem and the country's flag. So remember, before this, before she got locked up, she was all like, I'm standing in the locker room because they may change the rules. Like, yeah, y'all going to have to stand up. All right, because a lot of the advertisers were like pulling and they was getting tired of it. And a lot of there was getting a lot of backlash for it, too, acting like spoiled brats. OK, anyway, according to ESPN, Griner told reporters, quote, you have the right to protest, the right to be able to speak out, question, challenge and do all these things. Griner continued, when I went through and everything, I, it just it just makes sorry it just means a little bit more to me now uh-huh I bet it does <laughs> everybody over here speaking English okay well mostly everybody okay so I want to be able to stand I was literally in a cage in Russia and could not stand the way I wanted to just being able to hear my national anthem see my flag I definitely want to stand now everybody that will not now, Everybody that will not stand or not come out, I totally support them 100%. That's our right as American, as an American in this great country. Uh, let's see. After winning the Olympic gold medal with Team USA, Grinders' emotions could not be contained. And the basketball star has a newfound gratitude for this great country, according to the United States, USA Today. I... I uh, it took you getting locked up. Let me tell you something. Listen, I obey the laws. <laughs> I don't have no habits. As a matter of fact, because of all the, the, the drinking culture, I don't drink anymore when I came back to America. Like, it's it's so it's the custom to drink at your dinner and even at lunch. And I got so tired. Like, going from America to where I barely drank or I was socially drinking to, like, drinking, like, on a weekly basis, especially every weekend, I was like, okay, hey, I'm done with alcohol. We done. I don't want no more of this stuff no more. But I, I love America. I love the culture here. We have different cultures here. But I love the convenience of being an American. I love how everybody looks to us and try to uh, imitate us and they care what we think. It's just a great country and we have to save it from the invasion under uh, poopy pants biden's rule okay uh let's see quote it means so much more it means so much to me griner said i didn't think i'll be here like i've said before and then to be here winning gold for my country representing with my country fought so hard for me to even be standing here yeah this gold is going to hold a special place and then this is the video. So let's go ahead and look at this video recording. Like I said, I got to be careful. I got to be careful. So uh, this is what I'm going to do. So here's Brittany Griner right here. She's in the front. They all got their gold medals. So I'm going to, I'm going to, um, <laughs> I'm going to, uh, I'm going to mute this. And then I'm going to, I'm not going to sing. Okay. I'm just going to be like, uh, dun, 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 dun. That's what I'm going to do. Dun 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 Okay, that's I don't know who that is. Dun 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 she was upset. Look at her. Yeah, I bet you she. <laughs> she like, I'm not, I love America now. I just, I, they came and got me. <laughs> if I was white, I would still be in that jail right to this day. <laughs> so glad I'm mulatto or whatever the hell I am. <laughs> okay. Did, do they show some more here? Da, 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 da. Oh, oh, girl, go sing her heart out. Look at her. Da, 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 da. Okay. Oh, there's another picture of her. So they show another picture of her right here. Hold on a second. Is this girl? Is this, is this girl right here crying? 
Hold on. <laughs> oh, she is crying. Everybody crying. She crying. Brittany crying. Hold on. Let me look at this again. I, I wish I stopped hitting this button right here. There you go. Okay. I'm just going to let it play. I'm going to let it play. I hope they don't get me. How many seconds is this? No, I can't do it. It's, it's about 10 seconds. Okay, let me just let me just do it like this. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, there she go. Looking at it up there. And it says, she's crying. Brittany's crying some more. Okay. And there she go, wiping the tears from her eyes. They all happy. They say, we got the gold, baby. We got the gold. We got the gold. We got the gold. We got the gold. Yay, we got the gold. We got the gold. Uh-huh. All right, well, look. Okay, looks like, uh, hold on. What is this watching? Okay, there we go. Yeah. All right, there is that. I'm not going to make a long video. I just wanted to make a video let you guys know I'm here. I thought I, could, I was going to make the video about the Trump woman. I mean, um, the Trump uh, supporter who had a Karen come on his yard. Tell me something. Uh, excuse me, sir, but can you? I'm sorry, but the, you got to move that monstrosity off of your lawn because I'm offended. <laughs> I was going to talk about that, but I'm not going to do that. I'm just, I'm just going to do this video. Maybe, who knows, I'll probably do another one later on today. But anyway, just going to go. Let me know what you think, all right, by leaving a comment below this video. Don't forget to give me a like. Come on, give me a like. And if you're new to my channel, feel free to subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Later, taters.